Following the advocacy for drug reduction in the country, the chairman and CEO NDLA Brigadier General Mo Buba Marwa retired as identified the use of drugs and illicit substances as a major cause of destruction in Nigeria. Marwa disclosed this on Friday in Abuja. Here's the report. At the inauguration ceremony of the Federal Housing Authority, Lube Youth, with the team Community Action on Drug Abuse Awareness Campaign in Nigeria, the chairman, NDLEA, Brigadier General Mohamed Marua, who was represented by the Deputy Commander, FCT, NDLEA Command, Ibrahim Adamu, charged traditional religious leaders and parents to join the fight against drug reduction in the communities and also in Nigeria. And in terms of uh, the, uh, the traditional ruler, they need to assist us by organizing uh, sensitization campaign on a regular basis by calling his people together. Then he will invite NDLA uh, to come to give lectures, talk on the dangers uh, inherent in the use of drugs. So at that time, they too, they are contributing their part. And again, they can still give information of those who are large-scale um, stockists. What I mean, those who keep drugs, they live within the, their, their environment. They should be able to be bold enough to bring the information. Also speaking, Dan Lamicheta and Solomon Adudu lauded the initiatives, adding that the minions of drug abuse has eaten deep into the society. If these people will know where these drugs are produced, what is the next, what is the next step of the government doing? What is the government doing about all these issues? And because we have some problem in the, in the community, maybe when you call that you have seen a group of people taking this, before you know, three days, two days, those people that have been arrested, you see them in the community again. And we look at you that you are doing all this, you don't know what you are doing. Because by the next time you see the person that you say, okay, this is the person that was doing this for a few days. Next day, tomorrow you see him in the set again. And you, if you try to tell your life will be at danger. So that's why sometimes information, just some people doesn't give information of these days. So I urge the NDLE and the Security and Civil Defense Corps to sit up on this. See that there should be punishment for this. So I others will learn. When you punish somebody today, I believe others will learn tomorrow they will not do it again. If the problems of Nigeria must be solved, then it will not be done in isolation. It will not be done by an alien. It will not be done just by those who we feel today can solve it. It will be done by you and I. And the time is coming again. Let us begin to restate our belief in ourselves. Let's begin to look and eviscerate. Check around our surroundings. How can we make Nigeria better? Let's begin to tell ourselves again what the essence of leadership is. While lending the voice to the matter, George Chidi and Igwe Martins highlighted the importance of sensitizing the community on drug abuse, adding that drug is the cause of insecurity in Nigeria. The rate of drug abuse in the community is getting is alarming, it's getting is rising. So I want to coll collaborate with NGLA to have an awareness program in all the communities that make up Airport Road and Lube and also target the schools, primary schools and secondary schools within. So that we sensitize to these children, culture them, give them uh, lectures for them to know the effect of drugs. Community action on drug abuse are activities that are centered on community impact towards reducing the effect of drugs in the community, design ways of achieving this, and collectively mobilize the community towards achieving this effort, which will help in reducing conflict and enhance peace in our community. As the NDLEA continues to war against drug trafficking, it's hoped that drug crimes will be dealt with decisively in the country.